Hey guys, how's it going? It's X666X Iron Maiden, and today we're back on the E3 2018 to check out Ghost of Tsushima, a full gameplay reveal with flute from the Sony E3 panel. Alright, so, including flute, I'm going to K. Let's check this out. I, I want to check this one out specifically. Um, it looked good from the small clip that I had seen. I haven't seen this full reveal. I've only seen a few seconds uh, of this. Uh, just because it passed on Facebook. It automatically plays videos. So I've seen a few seconds. It looked cool. Um, I haven't known a PlayStation forever or anything like that. I don't even know if it's only available from Sony or if other companies are doing it as well. But uh, I still want to check it out. And then seeing that it actually has a, a, a flutist actually playing along with the trailer is cool as well, so let's check it out. This one's uh, 11 minutes long, so it should be a good gameplay reveal, uh, reveal for the game. Sorry guys, I accidentally full screen that. Pretty cool, actually.
Looks really good. Looks really good. The lighting, the lighting is what really makes it on this one though. Less the actual graphics, but the lighting. Hmm. Nobu, come. So good. The fighting, fighting system kind of looks really cool too. I don't know how the actual system works, but it looked pretty fluid. Never mind. Jin, you're late. You're impatient. Where's the monk? The bastards beat me to him. Now they're torturing him at the temple. Come on. And you came back this way? You think the monk's a hero. We need him, Masako. <laughs> Down. We can take them. No. Remember Sako Bridge. We strike quietly. And they kill the monks. <laughs> I'll guard the exits. Just get that monk. Nice. In Amaran Lahus's magic, we will be lost. To near Sushi Mag, I had a stuffed Mafia bun. Please, I do not understand. Will that we, Chamagot Unami? Uthmi Cheyavan Sakt, Chi Obelatno, Tizi Maria. Now we gotta fight. He called reinforcements. We have to move. Stand aside, Jin. 
You betrayed my family. Run! If we fight, the Mongols win. Ooh. They already won. Samurai on Samurai. Look at the... just look where they're fighting at. It looks so good. In areas, in areas where there's not a lot of leaves, you can see when they get pushed back and so the leaves actually move out of the way. And get cleared up a bit. Man, it looks good. I gotta give him that. That looks really good. If it lives up to it, that's a whole other thing. If it lives up to it, it's a whole other story. Obviously, with E3, you, can, you only get it's only a trailer. It's gameplay, but um, I think specific. Um, let's see what we got here. Someone in the comments says, and Ubisoft said uh, Assassin's Creed in Japan would not work, and they're basically saying that that's the same concept. Uh, but uh, it's 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 crazy how good it, how good that actually looked, though. Uh, it, it makes me want to get a PlayStation as well. Fuck, I wish games were not so set to certain consoles sometimes because I you can do that all you want. And I find this is the same thing with a lot of me and my friends is console specific games it works to a certain degree but most of us can't afford to buy multiple consoles and we're going to stick to the ones we've always had uh, for me it's PC now so buying consoles is kind of out of the question except maybe the Switch because uh, you know we got what I, I, I like just you know the, the multiplayer aspect of the Switch playing with other people um, I find it's a lot more compatible that you know Super Smash a lot of my friends are going to be getting it uh, tennis is back as well uh, they got a, a new uh, Mario Party coming which I have to check out the trailer for as well to see if it's actually worth it or if it's going to be garbage like the last one I'm hoping they came back to the old style of moving one by one instead of as a group um, anyway that's that's off on other games this, this game before I start going off on a bunch of E3 stuff uh is stunning graphically it's stunning um, you can tell right off the bat as soon as it started that it was going to be an amazing looking game that's the reason why I checked out in the first place because it looked like it would be amazing uh, oh excuse me guys because it's not stop yawning as usual um, I'm hoping the game mechanics itself it looks really fluid in combat curious if it's like similar to like I don't know like For Honor style or, or whatnot, um, buttons wise, uh, and hopefully it's something that's really easy to use and it's very fluid, um, because one thing with For Honor, so every once in a while I found that it wasn't very fluid and uh, it kind of made it made for a rough game sometimes. 
Uh, I'm hoping this is, doesn't have that same issue because it looks good and I'm hoping the story is actually super intense. It looks like it might be uh, from just that small glimpse of it. It looks like it could be a super intense story. And this is based at the time of the Mongols. Um, Brushing up on my history while we do this. Mongols, Mongols. Checking what year that uh, this were they were around in, because I cannot remember. Um, let's see if we can get a year here. And of course. In 1206. He was because Genghis Khan was proclaimed the ruler of the Mongols in 1206. So uh, it'll be either around that time, right after, somewhere around that time for this, uh, I'm sure, for this game, which is really cool. Uh, I love Samurai, so it's going to be a cool game to check out anyway. Hopefully, I get a chance to play it at some point. Either someone owns it and I can play it on their PlayStation or something like that because I don't have one. Also, not sure if this is only going to be on Sony. I guess that's something we could look up right now. Uh, let's see here. Uh, da, 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 da. It's exclusive, yeah. Of course it's exclusive. Yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed checking this one out with me. If you did, make sure you hit the like button. Don't forget to subscribe to see more from me. I'm also on Patreon if you'd like to support the channel. And as always, you guys have a good one. I'll catch you later.